here's the situation. Casey Neistat is my inspiration for YouTube, and he's talking in Alabama today. If you didn't know, I spent all my money on a drone, so I've been a little short on funds lately. I finally have enough money saved, and I go to buy a ticket, and they're sold out. So, I'm just gonna go over there, and hope I can get in. Just got some Sharpies and poster board, and I feel like I'm gonna need them. I just got to Birmingham. I do not think this is gonna work. I just talked to the people over at Sloss Tech and there's good news and bad news. The bad news is they don't have any more tickets to sell. The good news is that one of the workers told me if I hang out there, she might be able to get me a ticket. So we'll see, I'm about to head back over there now. All right, let's see if this works. So I didn't film this next part because I was so focused on getting a ticket, but here's the story. Everyone at the conference came outside for a break right before Casey's talk, and then one of the employees saw me holding the sign and told me to stay put. And then this happened. Hey, can we let this guy in? Don't you know somebody? <laughs> We're trying, man. We can't get him in. I wish I could help you guys. <laughs> As you can tell, I missed most of the shot. I was completely starstruck. I just stood there smiling and speechless like an idiot. But it's really cool to think that Casey came outside to meet me. Right after that, one of the employees came and got me and told me that somebody had a ticket for me. You don't have a ticket? I think I might have one. Uh, I got one. Do you have an extra one? I'm the one who, I think I'm the one who's oh, okay. gonna give you the ticket. This guy? All right, sure. You want me to give you anything? Nope. You Thank you it. so much, man. Yeah, I really appreciate yeah, it. Oh, that is awesome. I can definitely put your name on okay. this for you. What is very soon. And he is one of just the great creative geniuses of our day. We had the opportunity to talk to him for a minute. Everything he does is out of his love for his creative spark and for you guys, the audience. We're going to show a quick video, so don't clap yet. But after that video, I want you to give the most hand callousing, hell raising, ear splitting round of applause that this guy's ever heard. There's a success at the end of the tunnel that started with something that was nothing more than a small idea. And uh, I think to me, that's what really, what it really means to be an entrepreneur. And as I look back and I see this pattern throughout my own experiences, um, you know, having lived in this space now for 20 years, trying to find success here, having no idea what I'm doing. And I can't underscore that enough. I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I never have any idea what I'm doing. Because the truth is, like, to succeed, to exist in this world of being an entrepreneur, it means there is, by definition, there's no instruction manual. If any of you out there trying to do something, trying to build something, or trying to follow some prescription that somebody else defined, you failed. You have already failed. You will not succeed. You can write that down, you will not succeed. If there are 10,000 sheep with white fur, fur, what does sheep have, wool? <laughs> the the sheep. 10,000 white woolen sheep going that way, and you're like, wow, yeah, I want to succeed. Let me jump in line with these sheep. And like, well, how come nobody's noticing me? Like, nobody's gonna notice you. You gotta be the one that steps out. You gotta be the wolf that runs in the opposite direction. And that's what it takes. It, it's, it's embracing the idea that you have to define it for yourself. Not only did I get a ticket, but I also get to meet Casey. I hope you guys liked that. If you did, smash that subscribe button. I think it would be really neat if Casey actually saw this video. So tweet this video at him. He really is the inspiration for my starting YouTube. And as I'm sure you can tell by the style, this is more than just the story of the one time I got to see Casey. This video is also a tribute to him for giving me that creative spark to start my own channel. So, please do that. Oh, and I have really exciting news coming very soon, so stay tuned.